Ah, this is exactly what I wanted to paint. To make this ugly space an art space. Like a wave. Yeah, I think this will be interesting. Hello friends and followers, now you probably ask yourself where the hell is Mode today? And today I want to take you to, um, to a painting on this wall over there. This whole space that you can see here, which looks pretty ugly, um, will be a restaurant in a few weeks. And the concept is to make this ugly space an art space. And uh, I am one of the artists, and this over there is my wall. Yeah, I think this will be interesting. Well, I hope it doesn't take too long. Okay, friends and followers, this is everything that I managed today. I wanted to create a style that is more in motion. Like you can see, there is one, like a wave. Okay. <laughs> Super satisfied with the left side of the M. Um, with this arrow that is coming out of the E down there, I want to change this a little bit and I want to change the single click of extra bar extension from the E. And, um, but the MO combination over there and the S are pretty dope. So. Yeah, I want to change a little bit here and there, um, but I already like what I see there. And we see us tomorrow. Whoa, and we are back in business. Day two, and it was really, really hard for me to leave this first lines like they are. Yesterday in the evening, I was looking on this first lines and I was thinking, I want to change this, change this. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So yeah, let's work on the first lines. First lines, first lines. I'll put you over here. Okay, I had to make a lot of adjustments of the single connected extra bar of the E uh, to bend it so much that it goes through the eye of the E. Because, I tell you now why it is so important. Because the E, before I made these changes, it had nothing in the eye or in the mouth. Eh? And nothing in the holes. No other elements in a second layer in one of the holes of the whole letter. And the O has even two other elements from the E and from the M inside of the hole. The M has in, in its black space in general, in the whole part, it has the S. 
and some part of the O. And even the S has this little part of the M inside of the mouth of the S. To balance it out, to have something in one of the holes of the E. And now I am happy. These are super tiny details. Wow! That was amazing! Holy cow, look at these details. I'm super happy with those rocks and those mountains and crazy landscape and clouds. I'm coming back slowly to an era. It was about 2012 when I had um, real problems with painting letters. I was painting nearly only pop surrealistic canvases and I have a lot of them still at home. Now I can combine the knowledge of this era when I was doing all those um, classic pop surrealistic paintings, landscapes and all this stuff. Oh man, oh man, this, ah, oh, ah, oh, I'm nearly crying. Sorry, this is, uh, Ah, this is exactly what I wanted to paint. Okay, I'm super, super happy with the old fashioned color scheme that I used here and I can't wait to paint some outlines now. It does not look like graffiti anymore, it looks like art. This is the best painting that I've ever made. Wow. Did I tell you that I want to sell this um, canvas in the middle? Um, I will give you more information about this in the video description and probably at the end of this video. But man, this is intense. Everything's done now, but I still want to add a little bit of reddish glow and in a few seconds you will see how it looks like. <laughs> Yo, friends and followers, um, just
Just a quick word about the canvas. Yes, it will be for sale and I will inform you about this on social. So please consider subscribing to this YouTube channel and subscribing to my Instagram account. Um, I will inform you about every detail, how it will be sold and everything. Big thanks to Montana Cans for supporting me with your best with your best pullovers and um, spray cans and all this stuff. Thanks a lot for supporting me. It's linked over there. And uh, yeah, I hope that you were a little bit entertained and we see us in the next project.